If you've never driven in Germany before, it can be a little daunting and so it is best to be prepared. Watch these 22 tips for driving in Germany that you need to know before you go. Make sure you catch all 22, so that you don't get caught with having to pay a hefty fine if you unintentionally break the law. Tip 1. One high visibility vest must be carried in the passenger compartment of your vehicle for each occupant. If you break down you must wear it as soon as you get out of your vehicle. Tip 2. All four-wheeled vehicles must carry a warning triangle. In the event of a breakdown this should be placed 50 meters away from the vehicle, upstream of traffic. Tip 3. All four-wheeled vehicles registered in Germany must carry a first aid kit. A good kit should include band-aids, cotton balls, gauze pads, bandage, hand sanitizer, antiseptic, antibiotic ointment, pain relief like paracetamol or ibuprofen, bug spray, and tweezers. Tip 4. All UK cars must have headlamp beam converters. This is to avoid dazzling other road users. Tip 5. All passenger cars and motorbikes must be fitted with winter tires in wintry conditions. All season tires are also acceptable. Vehicles with snow chains are subject to a speed limit of 50 km per hour. This became law in Germany in 2010. Tip 6. There is a lower drink drive limit in Germany than in England. Private drivers must have less than 0.05% of alcohol in their blood. For newly qualified drivers with less than 2 years experience, and drivers under the age of 21, the limit is 0%. Tip 7. Be aware of speed limits. Unless otherwise directed, built-up areas are usually 50 km per hour. Outside of built-up areas, roads are 100 km per hour, and motorways have a recommended speed limit of 130 km per hour. Tip 8. The driver and all passengers must wear seat belts. The driver is responsible for ensuring all passengers under 18 years of age are wearing appropriate restraints. Tip 9. Children over 3 years old must travel in the rear. Children under 12 years old or shorter than 150 cm must have a child seat or child restraint which must conform to European safety standards. Tip 10. Camper vans and cars towing caravans must not exceed 18.75 meters in length, 4 meters in height and 2.55 meters in width. Loads must not exceed 11.5 tons at the driving axle and 10 tons at a single axle. Tip 11. You must not use speed camera detectors. If you have this function on your satellite navigation system, it must be disabled. Tip 12. In the event of an emergency, you can dial 112 from anywhere in Europe. The operator will connect you to the emergency service in the country you are visiting. Tip 13. To drive in Germany you must be at least 18 and have a full license. If you are riding a motorbike or moped up to 125 cc, you must be at least 16. Tip 14. You must carry your full valid UK driving license, passport, copy of your insurance, and your V5 form in the car with you. You no longer need an insurance green card to drive in Germany. Tip 15. You must display a UK sticker. This may be incorporated in your number plate. GB and EU stickers are no longer valid for driving abroad. Tip 16. In Germany, petrol is called benzin, unleaded is bleifrei is benzin, and diesel is the same, diesel. Some German pumps use chip and pin. Tip 17. 
In Germany wheel clamps are not used, but vehicles can be towed away for illegal parking. A vehicle is considered parked if it is stationary for more than three minutes. Vehicles parked on a public highway at night should be illuminated front and rear. Tip 18. Be aware of different driving customs. For example, in Germany you must not overtake a school bus that has stopped to let passengers off. Tip 19. As in England it is illegal to use a handheld mobile phone while driving. However, you may use a hands-free system. Tip 20. In environmental green zones you must display an environmental badge. These can be purchased online. Environmental green zones are called umwelt zones. Tip 21. Autobahns are the equivalent to motorways. There are no tolls on German autobahns but you must pay a motorway tax on all vehicles and vehicle combinations exceeding 7.5 tons, which is electronically levied. Tip 22. Drive on the right-hand side of the road. Remember, that also means that you must drive anti-clockwise on roundabouts. Thank you for watching. At Club Drive we have many more videos to help you with your driver training. Please like this video, share it with your friends and subscribe to our channel. And please consider clicking the thanks button. Thank you.